hello friends welcome again to my channel welcome in this video in this video i will show you how to make a timer app in sketchwear so let's start at first i am creating an app giving it timer this is a bit hard work and so the tutorial must be so big I want that I want to I want to finish it in 10 minutes so at first what I'm going to do is to is give a linear edge another linear edge here and then give a text view giving the gravity center horizontal vertical I am going to give its name like this you have to do it in order to make a good app like, like this 30 sp may be all right i'm giving a button uh, i'm going to make this app of one button and so i'm giving the name of it is the name of this is start stop reset here you go all are okay now we have to go to on activity create and then we have to create five variables one h for hours uh, m for minutes s for second sorry i have done a mistake here sorry i have done a mistake don't do this s for second and m s for uh, millisecond and then at last another I am going to give a here you go I have created variables successfully and then we have to give 5 set number 2 here five H M S M S and then A I I should write the all of this zero. This means uh, from from the starting of the app all will count zero. All all will show zero when you start the app. We have done all of the work of on activity create then view and then button on clicked at first go to control and give this code and then go to operator and give this here if uh, if a equal to zero then so friends i i don't know how to make this app successfully so i am watching from from a taken picture from here if a equal to zero then set number two one set number a two one and then we have to give a, a component now sorry oh and after the work we have to go to component and create a timer naming timer then we have to go to the same place again and go to component and we have to give a timer 
after this we have to write here 10 and 10 same after that this and then this we have to say the number a oh sorry I made a mistake we have to number give ms I made a mistake again extremely sorry what I have to do is to um, uh, We have to go to number timer in the number ms increase one and then give the control if then operator <coughs> and then here you go if ms equal to 100 then one hundred then number increase and then set number number if ms equal to 100 second increase one and ms set to zero after that we have to give another if then operator if then control and this if s equal to 60 then Label number in prison set number two number if s equal to sixty then and increase one and set number s to zero again the same thing if then operator and then variables number increase one set number two if if m equal to sixty then number h increase one and m set to zero so we are okay after that what we have to do is to give to a uh, text view there and then if a equal to 1 set number 2 tiger cancel view text view here after that we have to go to here and um, set number 2 Hit number A equal to one. Set number A if A equal to one. Oh, sorry, A equal to one. Set number A equal to two. Timer cancel. So we have to give the control if then. I think so. No if else and then again if then we have to give a if else operator and then under it we have to give if then then we have to give operators again if a equal to one then set a 
equal to 2 if you equal to 1 set 2 and timer timer cancel and we have to give a component of timer cancel after that what we have to do is to give another a variable here if a equal to 2 then so then what we have to do is to go to the on activity create and copy this I am copied all this and then saving this in my collection uh, navigate any 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 name you can give to it it's your decision and then go to air and here you see my any collection and I have set this here I hope that the work is done almost fully we have to give a text view here text view here set text button set text text view 1 and set text text view 1 now the work is 80% done we have to work for the set text now at first we have to go to operator and give the join and operator at first on both after that join else to decimal format 0 and join uh, I have to go to operator again to decimal format uh, here you see the uh, to decimal format we have to we have to take another because of using then go to variable if h to decimal format zero zero h to decimal format zero zero and and we have to give another join and there join h format and join then we have to give type here this say colon and then give another join and and join we have to take another two decimal format variable here h to m then m to decimal format zero zero we have to set it here here you see a join m to decimal format and we have to give another operator join uh, join and there and join another colon and another join and I think so colon and join I think so I think so uh, I think so it will happen in this fact and join and uh, join colon and join m to decimal but yes we are right we have to go to r to decimal format and uh, give a uh, 
variable of h and s now is to decimal format zero zero and then we have to place it here and <coughs> and give here we should give here a colon I think so I think so colon I think so colon try this this will be that colon and uh, join now what we have to do is to oops we don't have to give her any, any colon we have to give a operator here of join end and uh, give here another uh, decimal Uh, where to decimal format of ms ms to decimal format zero zero saved it and at last you can give a full stop here okay our app is ready so, so what we have to do is to uh, first I'm deleting it and then copying it then giving it here at last our app creating is successful now what we have to do is to run the app before running I'm giving a simple color here um, uh, the color background color my favorite color pink now I am running the app the video is quite big I am so sorry but I have to do you see I didn't waste any time but making the app is not so easy at all now here you see now you can see easily that here the thing is not working so properly i have did it uh, knowing this because you can learn a thing from here now you see here that after giving a zero zero after giving a zero zero we have given colon but here after giving zero zero we haven't given any colon and so the thing is here like this so we have to change it to change it what we have to do is to um, give here and join colon save and it should be here and we have to cut it at first and tap it here and give it here to decimal format zero zero We have to do the same here. We have to delete it. Um, I have deleted it. Now I am copying it. After that, I am pasting it here. Now I am saving the app. Progress. The app is running. The app is the video time is much big. Here you see. Now I, I am I, if I give it here you see. The app is working so properly as you liked. Please wait 10 seconds. Here you see. The app is working so properly. If I tap again, it stops. If I tap again, it resets. So thank you for watching this video for a long time. Please subscribe my channel to get more videos of SketchUp tutorials. Thank you for watching this.